So age or generation are quite interesting uh, aspects of sleep medicine. They're typically, we, I would look at them in, in somewhat generalities. Any individual person, of course, may or may not have these effects. But as young people enter into adolescence, they tend to want to have their, their sleep cycle tends to shift so that they want to go to bed later and then get up later. This is to some degree or partially the source of the delayed school start time debate. So that, that can factor in, and if that goes too far, it can be problematic, and they can develop what's called delayed sleep phase syndrome, for which you want to see uh, seek medical care. On the other end of the age spectrum is as people age, they tend to rotate their sleep time forward and become advanced. And so people will start to sometimes, as they get older, go to bed earlier and earlier. This sometimes is uh, discussed in humorous anecdotes or comedians' jokes and whatnot. However, if it goes too far, then they can start to go to bed so early that their life can become dysfunctional. And so we have to use different therapeutic interventions such as light therapy and other behavioral interventions to move their sleep time further back and delay it so it gets closer to the normal societal sleep time. So these are factors that we do discuss daily. For more information on Clayton Sleep Institute and sleep information, please go to our website at claytonsleep.com or look me up and Clayton Sleep Institute up on LinkedIn. Follow us and we'll try to share great sleep information with you as fast as we can.